Hello, I'm Nick, and welcome to Technology. Last time we looked at overclocking your graphics card using MSI Afterburner. Today we'll be using the same software to overlay your computer stats just as you see in many gaming videos. Ok let's get started. Firstly what you'll need to do is download and install MSI Afterburner. I'll put the download link in the description below. Ok once you've downloaded and installed this, open up MSI Afterburner. It will look something like this. If you also click on your system tray at the bottom right, there'll be an icon for a program called Revertuner Statistics Server. Open this up. Now this was installed alongside MSI Afterburner and this is what actually produces the overlay. At the top there is Show On Screen Display and you want to turn that on. If you look down the list on the right hand side, you'll have the On Screen Display Rendering Mode. With this you can change what the text looks like. You can also add a drop shadow to the text to help it stand out a bit more. And increase the text size by using the Display Zoom slider. Here you can select which corner you want the text to be displayed in and you can fine tune the positioning by using the arrow keys at the bottom. Down the left hand side you can create custom profiles for each individual application but I like to keep mine on global. This means the same settings are applied to all programs. Ok let's minimise this down and go back into MSI Afterburner. Then go down to the bottom and open up settings. Then head over to the monitoring tab at the top. Under the Active Hardware Monitoring Graph section, you have all the aspects which will be monitored, which can be anything from GPU usage all the way to page file usage. You can select or unselect the ones you want to be monitored by clicking on this arrow at the side of each one. So go down the side and deactivate all the ones you don't want. So all the ones you've now selected will show up in MSI Afterburner's Hardware Monitoring window, but we still need to get these to show up in-game. You do this by selecting the one you want to show up, and scrolling down to show in on screen display and tick this box. This will now show up in games. If you have a Logitech device with an LCD display you can also get all this information to show up on that by selecting the tick box. Then adjust the font size accordingly. Alternatively you can have it show up in your system tray whilst using Windows just generally. Once you've selected which options you want, repeat for each property you want to be displayed. Once you've done that, you can organise where you want each one to appear. So if I was to drag and drop GPU usage above GPU temperature, this would now appear in front or above on the overlay. Ok, once you've done that, go into the on-screen display tab at the top and configure which key you want to be used to turn the overlay on or off. Finally head over to the user interface tab at the top and select which temperature and time formats you wish to be displayed. You're now good to go. Launch a game and enjoy. Ok so that's it for this video. If you liked it like it. If you disliked it leave a comment below. I have lots more video ideas coming up so don't forget to subscribe.